The Mikuyan MiG-31, known by its NATO reporting name Foxhound, is a supersonic interceptor aircraft developed by the Soviet Union. Renowned for its speed, range, and advanced interception capabilities, the MiG-31 has been a cornerstone of Russia's air defense strategy since its introduction. Its design reflects an emphasis on intercepting high-speed and high-altitude targets, including bombers and cruise missiles, making it one of the most formidable interceptors in the world. Its robust airframe constructed to withstand the stresses of supersonic flight supports an empty weight of 48,100 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of 101,800 pounds. Powered by two Solovyev D30 F6 after-burning turbofan engines, each generating 151.9 kN of thrust, the MiG-31 is capable of reaching speeds up to 1,864 miles per hour at high altitudes. The aircraft's operational range is approximately 900 miles without refueling, with an extended ferry range of 2,050 miles. Its service ceiling is an impressive 67,600 feet, allowing it to intercept targets at extreme altitudes. The MiG-31 is equipped with a versatile weapons loadout, including various air-to-air -air missiles. A critical feature of the MiG-31 is its Zaslan Phased Array Radar System. The McDonnell Douglas F-15 Eagle is a twin-engine all-weather tactical fighter jet designed to secure and maintain air superiority during aerial combat. In terms of performance, the F-15 is unparalleled in its class. It can reach speeds of 1,650 miles per hour, making it one of the fastest fighter jets in operation. With a combat range of 1,100 miles and a service ceiling of 65,000 feet, the aircraft can execute missions in diverse and challenging environments. Its exceptional acceleration and agility ensure it can outmaneuver and outperform adversaries in any aerial confrontation. The empty weight of the F-15 is approximately 29,900 pounds, with a maximum takeoff weight reaching 81,000 pounds. Powered by two Pratt & Whitney afterburning turbofan engines, the F-15 delivers remarkable thrust and efficiency. The F-15 is armed with a 20mm M61 Vulcan cannon, which is highly effective in close-range combat. It is also equipped with a versatile missile loadout. The jet's radar system offers superior tracking and targeting capabilities, and electronic warfare systems provide robust defensive and offensive capabilities, enabling the F-15 to operate effectively in both friendly and enemy-controlled airspace. The General Dynamics F-111 Aardvark was a groundbreaking supersonic multi-role combat aircraft developed in the 1960s. It had a maximum takeoff weight of 100,000 pounds, powered by two Pratt & Whitney after-burning turbofan engines. It could reach speeds of up to 1,650 miles per hour and had a maximum range of 3,690 miles. The aircraft also boasted a service ceiling of 66,000 feet, allowing it to operate at extremely high altitudes. One of the F-111's most innovative features was its variable sweep wings. These wings allowed the aircraft to adjust the angle of the wings for optimal performance during different flight regimes. The wings could be extended to 16 degrees for takeoff and landing, providing stability at low speeds, or swept back to 72.5 degrees for high-speed supersonic flight. The aircraft was also equipped with an automated terrain-following radar system, allowing it to fly at low altitudes while contouring the ground. The aircraft could carry a wide variety of conventional and nuclear weapons, including bombs, missiles, and air-to-surface rockets. The Su-27 is powered by two Lyoka AL-31F afterburning turbofan engines, each generating 123 kN of thrust, allowing the aircraft to reach speeds up to 1,553 miles per hour. This gives the Su-27 a combat radius of about 1,500 km, ensuring it can cover vast distances during missions. The aircraft's maximum takeoff weight is 34,500 kilograms, while its empty weight is 16,380 kilograms. It also has a service ceiling of 18,000 meters, which enables it to operate at high altitudes. The Su-27 features a length of 21.94 meters, a wingspan of 14.7 meters, and a height of 5.92 meters. Its wing area spans 62 square meters, providing excellent maneuverability and stability, crucial for air superiority tasks. The aircraft is designed for one crew member, a pilot, and can carry a range of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles. Notably, it is equipped with a 30mm GHH-31 cannon and can carry missiles such as the R-27 and R-73, offering flexibility in engaging enemy aircraft or ground targets. The aircraft is also equipped with advanced radar and electronic warfare systems, further enhancing its effectiveness in both offensive and defensive operations. The Sukhoi Su-57 Felon is Russia's fifth-generation multi-role stealth fighter designed for air superiority and strike missions. 
The Su-57 is powered by two Saturn AL-41 F1 afterburning turbofan engines, enabling it to reach speeds of 1,535 miles per hour. It can sustain supersonic flight without the use of afterburners, a capability known as Super Cruise, which improves fuel efficiency and extends its operational range. With a combat radius exceeding about 930 miles, the Su-57 can operate effectively over long distances. The aircraft also has an impressive service ceiling of 66,000 feet, allowing it to perform missions at extremely high altitudes. The Su-57 is designed with a low radar cross-section, incorporating stealth features that reduce its detectability by enemy radar systems. With an empty weight of 40,785 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of 77,162 pounds, the aircraft combines high performance with maneuverability and versatility. One of the standout features of the Su-57 is its advanced avionics suite. The aircraft is equipped with integrated systems, including cutting-edge radar and electronic warfare equipment, which enhance situational awareness, allowing the pilot to track and engage multiple targets simultaneously. The Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor is a fifth-generation, single-seat, twin-engine stealth fighter developed specifically for the United States Air Force. With its cutting-edge combination of stealth, super cruise, exceptional maneuverability, and integrated avionics, the F-22 is a highly advanced aircraft designed to dominate both air superiority and multi-role combat missions. The F-22's empty weight is approximately 43,400 pounds, and it has a maximum takeoff weight of 38,083,800 pounds. Powered by two Pratt & Whitney, the F-22 can reach speeds of up to 1,500 miles per hour. The F-22 is also equipped with super cruise capability, allowing it to sustain supersonic speeds without using afterburners. Equipped with highly advanced avionics, the F-22 features integrated radar and electronic warfare systems that improve situational awareness and combat effectiveness. Its wingspan and aerodynamic design provide exceptional lift and stability, while its wing area of 78 square meters contributes to superior agility and maneuverability in the air. The aircraft's combat radius exceeds about 1,000 miles, making it highly effective for long-range missions. Its powerful engines, combined with advanced aerodynamics and stealth capabilities, make the F-22 Raptor one of the most advanced and capable fighter jets in the world. The Chengdu J-20, also known as the Mighty Dragon, is a fifth-generation stealth fighter aircraft developed by China's Chengdu Aircraft Corporation. The aircraft utilizes a blended fuselage and canard delta wing configuration, which helps reduce its radar cross-section and improve its survivability in contested environments. These stealth characteristics allow the J-20 to operate effectively in airspaces where advanced detection systems are present, enhancing its ability to avoid enemy radar and strike undetected. The J-20 is also equipped with sophisticated avionic systems that provide exceptional situational awareness for the pilot. It is capable of air-to-air -air combat, precision strike missions, and intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance operations, giving it a multi-role capability that allows it to adapt to different combat situations. This flexibility makes the J-20 a valuable asset for a wide range of military operations, from defending airspace to conducting deep strike missions. Its height is 4.45 meters, and it has a wing area of 50 square meters, contributing to its aerodynamic efficiency and maneuverability at both high and low speeds. The J-20 has an empty weight of approximately 19,000 kilograms and can reach a maximum takeoff weight of up to 77,162 pounds. Powered by two WS-10C turbofan engines, the aircraft has a maximum speed of around 1,522 miles per hour. Its combat radius is approximately 746 miles, allowing it to cover a significant operational range during missions. The North American X-15 was an innovative rocket-powered aircraft developed in the late 1950s to push the boundaries of hypersonic flight and near-space exploration. First flown in 1959, this experimental vehicle served as a critical bridge between traditional atmospheric flight and the early stages of space travel. The X-15 achieved groundbreaking milestones, becoming the first winged aircraft to fly at speeds exceeding Mach 6 while also reaching altitudes beyond 100,000 feet. These missions set records for speed and altitude, with the aircraft capable of reaching altitudes above 350,000 feet, effectively venturing into the lower reaches of space. Its exceptional performance allowed eight of the 12 pilots to earn astronaut wings by surpassing the 50-mile altitude mark, demonstrating its pivotal role in advancing the boundaries of human flight. Measuring 50 feet 9 inches in length with a wingspan of 22 feet 4 inches, it was powered by a rocket engine capable of producing immense thrust to achieve hypersonic speeds. 
The aircraft's range extended to 280 miles, and it was specifically built to gather critical data on the effects of extreme speeds and altitudes on both the vehicle and its pilot. The research derived from the X-15 program significantly enhanced the understanding of supersonic and hypersonic flight regimes and contributed directly to the development of spacecraft and the Apollo missions. The Lockheed SR-71 Blackbird was an extraordinary long-range, high-altitude reconnaissance aircraft that served the United States Air Force from 1964 until its retirement in 1990. Renowned for its unmatched performance, the SR-71 was capable of reaching speeds exceeding Mach 3, solidifying its position as the fastest air-breathing manned aircraft ever built. This hypersonic speed enabled it to outrun most threats, rendering it virtually untouchable by enemy aircraft and surface-to-air missiles during its missions. The aircraft's design was centered around high-altitude performance, with the SR-71 capable of soaring above 85,000 feet, far higher than most other aircraft of its time. This allowed the Blackbird to gather intelligence in hostile territories while remaining out of the reach of most interceptors. One of the standout features of the SR-71 was its stealth capabilities, which included its titanium airframe and a radar-absorbing design that minimized its radar cross-section, making it exceptionally difficult to detect. Equipped with advanced reconnaissance technology, including high-resolution cameras and specialized sensors, the SR-71 played a crucial role in intelligence-gathering missions, providing vital information during the Cold War. On July 20, 1963, the aircraft demonstrated its incredible speed and altitude capabilities by reaching Mach 3 at 78,000 feet, showcasing the exceptional performance that defined its legacy. The MiG-25 was one of the fastest military aircraft ever developed, known for its remarkable speed and ability to operate at extremely high altitudes. Originally designed by the Soviet Union to intercept high-speed bombers and reconnaissance planes, it was powered by two engines capable of propelling the aircraft to speeds as high as Mach 2.83. This speed was crucial for the MiG-25's role, as it allowed the aircraft to engage fast-moving targets before they could reach their intended objectives. The airframe of the MiG-25 was constructed primarily from stainless steel, chosen for its strength and ability to withstand the intense heat produced during high-speed flight. This robust design enabled the aircraft to maintain its structural integrity at altitudes exceeding 80,000 feet, where it could operate at its peak efficiency. Equipped with advanced radar systems and capable of carrying up to four air-to-air -air missiles, the MiG-25 was an intimidating presence in the sky with formidable intercept capabilities. However, the MiG-25's design prioritized speed and altitude over maneuverability, meaning it was not as agile as other fighter aircraft from its era. Initially, there were many misconceptions about the MiG-25's capabilities in the West, with many believing it was far more advanced than it truly was. This myth was shattered in 1976 when a Soviet pilot defected to the West, bringing a MiG-25 with him. The Lockheed YF-12 was an experimental aircraft developed by the United States in the early 1960s as part of a broader effort to create a high-performance interceptor for the Air Force. It was a prototype that ultimately led to the development of the more famous SR-71 Blackbird. The YF-12 was designed to be a long-range, high-speed and high-altitude aircraft capable of intercepting enemy bombers and missiles, providing an essential role in the Cold War era's strategic defense efforts. Powered by two Pratt & Whitney J-58 engines, the YF-12 was capable of reaching speeds exceeding Mach 3, which placed it among the fastest aircraft ever built. Its design was highly similar to the SR-71, with a sleek aerodynamic fuselage constructed primarily from titanium to withstand the extreme temperatures generated by high-speed flight. The YF-12 was equipped with advanced radar and was capable of carrying a range of air-to-air -air missiles, including the AM-47 Falcon, designed for intercepting enemy aircraft at great distances. The aircraft demonstrated that it could operate at altitudes above 70,000 feet and maintain speeds well beyond Mach 3, making it a formidable interceptor. The Bell X-2, also known as Starbuster, was an experimental aircraft developed in the 1950s to explore flight dynamic speeds at Mach 3, equivalent to approximately 2,094 miles per hour. The aircraft was capable of soaring to altitudes of 126,198 feet, roughly 38,465 meters, offering a unique opportunity to gather data on high-speed flight and atmospheric conditions at extreme altitudes. However, the X-2 had a relatively brief endurance, lasting only about 10 minutes and 55 seconds at full thrust. 
This high-speed research plane was crafted from stainless steel and K-Monel, a copper-nickel alloy known for its ability to withstand extreme conditions. The X-2 featured a sleek, swept-wing design that was carefully engineered to optimize performance at high speeds. The aircraft had an empty weight of 12,375 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of 24,912 pounds. The aircraft was powered by a single Curtis Wright XLR-25 rocket engine, which offered a variable thrust range from 2,500 to 15,000 pounds. The North American XP-70 Valkyrie was a groundbreaking supersonic strategic bomber developed in the 1950s and 1960s to provide unmatched speed and altitude capabilities. The XP-70 was intended to fly at altitudes around 70,000 feet at 2300 miles per hour, allowing it to outrun and evade the most advanced Soviet interceptors and surface-to-air missiles of the time. The XP-70 featured an innovative delta wing design combined with variable sweep canard wings. This unique configuration allowed it to maintain optimal performance at both high speeds and extreme altitudes. The bomber was powered by six General Electric YJ-93 GE-3 turbojet engines. With a service ceiling of 70,000 feet, the XP-70 was well beyond the range of most surface-to-air missiles, further enhancing its role as a high-speed and high-altitude bomber. Its maximum takeoff weight was approximately 521,000 pounds, and its range was around 2,000 miles. The NASA X-43A was a groundbreaking unmanned hypersonic aircraft developed under NASA's HyperX program to explore advanced aerodynamics and propulsion technologies. On November 16, 2004, the X-43A achieved a historic breakthrough by reaching speeds close to Mach 10, roughly 7,000 miles per hour, at an altitude of approximately 110,000 feet. The X-43A, the program's most prominent variant, was a single-use vehicle measuring about 12 feet in length and equipped with a hydrogen-fueled scramjet engine. It was launched into flight attached to a modified Pegasus rocket, which itself was carried to the necessary altitude and speed by a Boeing B-52 Stratofortress. Once the desired conditions were achieved, the X-43A separated from the booster to continue flying under its power, marking a critical milestone in experimental aviation. This achievement set a world speed record for jet-powered aircraft and validated the feasibility of scramjet technology for sustained hypersonic flight within Earth's atmosphere. By utilizing atmospheric oxygen instead of carrying onboard oxidizers, the scramjet design allowed for more efficient propulsion at extreme speeds, opening the door to new possibilities in both air travel and space exploration. 